Chris, a frustrating, disappointing and heartbreaking night tonight. Uh, all three would sum up the way Wraith Rovers won the game tonight, wouldn't it? Yeah, I really saw. Um, I think it was summed up at the very end with the, the corner kick. Harry Milne gets ahead on it, bounces down, hits the post and bounces back out and none of us at the end of the scene. Even though we've got a load of players in there, I don't think we carried any real luck when it came to that. But um, I, I, most of the game, you know, we were in their half. That, but it shows you that in the championship, the first goal uh, is so important. If and if you know, it's a poor goal for us to give away. It's a good header from from Ewan Murray. He does well to, to finish it. He's still got to finish it. But it's a poor goal for us to lose. And then we, we huff and puff the second half, we, we just throw everything at it, we just can't quite get, get the equaliser. I'm going to talk about our attacking play, but that defensive goal lost has become far too similar to goals lost week in and week out. It's a problem because it's different players making individual concentration errors. How do you fix that? Yeah, I know, and it's, it's such a sore one because, as you say, it's different players. That It's not always the same person, It's it's been different players, it's individual errors at times, but... Um, I think across the piece, you know, we, we make chances. Brian hits the bar, Harry hits the post. We threw as much as we possibly could. Wraith, I, I've not seen the statistics. I'm guessing the, the stats will show that we were well on top in the game. Um, but Wraith end up defending it well. Um, but the minute you give a team the the first goal and in, in the lead, they've got something to defend, and that's what I felt was if Wraith Rovers defended in numbers, they defended it well, and uh, they made things stuffy. But we gave them something to actually defend when, you know, if we, if we don't give teams that lift, it's a different game. 